I think as the weather turns uh, and is more favorable to using the type of armored and mechanized uh, equipment that have been provided to them, I do think the Ukrainians will have opportunities to change the kind of dynamic uh, that you've seen on the front line uh, since the winter, which has kind of been this Bakhmutization of the conflict where the two sides uh, have fought over very small slivers of terrain, uh, trading uh, city blocks uh, and small parts of towns and, and countryside. Um, but the map is not fundamentally different uh, than it was uh, you know, three or four months uh, ago. And so I think they will be in a position uh, to change that uh, dynamic. Uh, the other thing um, that I think we can be certain of is that regardless of the outcome of the counteroffensive, Russia has already lost. By every measure, uh, Putin's objectives have not been uh, fulfilled and they will not be fulfilled. He wanted to wipe Ukraine off the map and absorb it into a broader Russian empire. That didn't happen. It's not going to happen. A sovereign, independent, democratic Ukraine will survive and endure. There's nothing the Russians uh, can do to change about that. He wanted to invade Ukraine to demonstrate uh, Russian power. Russia is going to emerge from this conflict weaker uh, than it was going in. He wanted to go in and divide the West and weaken NATO. He ha he's generated the exact opposite effect.